Hello there everyone, you know who I am, E.J. Templar, Alien Crusader from Beyond the Heavens, here to entertain and destroy through the power of me magic. And in this video I am going to be your political bullshit translator. So let us get underway to the bullshit, shall we? Get my ears on. Modern technology companies have enabled misinformation to poison our information environment. Information environment, oh. Some big words there, buddy. With little accountability to their users. They've allowed people who intentionally spread misinformation, what we call disinformation, to have extraordinary reach. They've designed product features, such as like buttons, that reward us for sharing emotionally charged content, not accurate content. And their algorithms tend to give us more of what we click on, pulling us deeper and deeper into a well of misinformation. So basically, in um, in layman's terms, he basically said this. There is information out there that's not certified by the state and the operatic mainstream media that is controlled by the same three-letter organization, the CIA, to control the what gets posted, where gets posted, what gets covered, and what gets buried. So you, the average Joe, um, basically what we're saying is that you don't have the right to research and find up alternative facts unless we approve it as truth. So uh, Facebook and other social medias have like buttons which allow people to find more content. So if someone is on the road to truth, enlightenment, and freedom from the mainstream tyranny, we do not like that. We do not like people discovering different fonts of information that may free you as a human being and will not allow you to be under our strict information network control that we do control. And the illusion here to all this bullshit is that Facebook, Twitter, and Google, they're already basically state-sponsored horseshit websites. So this is like just them in a veiled way of saying, oh, if you go against our status quo, that's misinformation. And here's some history for you. You know the word conspiracy theorist wasn't really a mainstream word until the 1970s. You see, when people started discovering things about the JFK assassination, Project Blue Book, and all these other instances, the CIA invented the word conspiracy theorist to basically denounce shame and bury up the truth, right? Because when you attach the connotation of conspiracy theorist to someone, it, it, it instantly gives off the negative impression that they're nutty, right? That they're Alex Jones-level uh, cringe-tier truth scavengers, right? But that's further from the truth. So, what was this deal hole's name? What was this? Murphy. Murphy? So, yeah, basically, this is the state saying to you that we don't like you researching, we don't like you going to independent news organizations, and we exceptionally don't like you posting your opinion, and we don't like you forming groups of enlightened individuality. We don't want you finding the truth that both parties, the Democrat and Republicans, are controlled by the same global entity that we can't name here on YouTube. And, yeah. They're, they're basically, not to repeat myself, but yeah, they're saying they don't want you to find out various topics, whatever it may be, and they just don't like people being free, they don't like freedom of information, and that's why there's so much, that's why Biden came out and said misinformation is killing people when it's not. Uh, you know what's killing people? Well, a lot of things, really, but... This is just one more step in tyranny that they want, right? The next thing is, uh, on top of, they already have a, a big way to control and contain information. So this is a way for them to appear like they're putting pressure to stop, uh, you know, misinformation from getting out. And it's also funny how he says emotionally charged content. Uh, when there's Antifa, BLM, cultural Marxists, and communists releasing emotionally charged information out there, like, on the daily. But 
this is just an ongoing war against truth, freedom, the American way, freedom of expression, freedom of research, and the freedom of information. So, yeah, keep keep hitting those likes. Keep going down that font for that misinformation well. Ooh, ooh. Stay free. Fuck these tyrants. Fuck whoever this guy is. And you remain free. You keep researching. You keep digging. You keep looking for information. And you keep mistrusting the mainstream media. And you keep mistrusting these assholes. Because at the end of the day, your soul is in your own keeping. And these people are just tyrannical shitheads. And you should ignore this asshole and ignore them all. Be your own truth seeker. Regardless of what side of the aisle you're on. And leave a like. Leave a dislike. Comment your thoughts below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And God willing, I'll see you guys next time.